welcome to Rio Expert channel. Today I am going to explain you how to insert sparkline chart to your Google Sheet data sheet. So sparkline chart is a very attractive chart type. So you can very simply create sparkline chart for your data for your uh, for data presentation. So there is a um, formula to create sparkline chart so if you follow these steps in my video so you can easily create or insert a, what we call the sparkline chart for your google sheet google spreadsheet so i select column a to enter uh, numbers from 1 to 10 so um, there I entered 1 to 10 numbers uh, not in order I mean but the max number is number 10 uh, look at the video then uh, A1 cell number 10 for A2 number uh, three and number five so i repeat number five twice then number four then number two number one number nine then number ten yeah number let's enter number six yes so that is the number range i used to create sparkline chart However, the max number, the maximum number is number 10. Then the sparkle line chart formula, uh, you have to, uh, I select the column B to enter the formula for my sparkle line graph. So I'm going to type uh, formula on uh, B1 cell. So So you have to begin the formula like this so equal button equal mark then spark line open the bracket then again uh, our reference cell is here a1 comma then you have to open curly braces again so within inverted commas, uh, type uh, type the chart type, then close inverted commas. Then again we have to open inverted commas and type bar. Then what? Then uh, then we have to give the max number here according to my data range. The maximum number is number ten. Yes, max number is number 10. Then the color selection, color 1. You have to type that part inside the uh, inverted commas. Then close inverted commas, then comma, then we have to enter the if condition, if function. So then uh, type if and again open brackets then within the brackets reference cell is a1 so if the a1 the condition is if the a1 is less than 7 then the sparkline graph color is red otherwise green so you have to type the color within uh, colors within inverted commas then close all the brackets like this then press enter so you can see uh, a sparkline chart for b1 then you have to drag the formula up to b10 cell like this yeah now you have very attractive sparkline chart with two colors so you can take multiple colors by adding ifs function so i will explain uh, ifs function also then there you can take multiple colors for you sparkling grab 
so if you want to take multiple colors for your spark line graph then you have to use ifs function so earlier we used if function so if you want to take uh, multiple colors for your spark line graph then uh, you have to uh, use ifs function so and the other parts of the formula is uh, same so they are the additionally you have to use the function ifs for uh, for the condition part so there are uh, here in this formula I have used three colors uh, red black and green so let's uh, let's try how to do this so as usual I use a column so there I enter numbers from 1 to uh, 100 so 10 to 100 from A12 column to uh, A21 then the function um, spark line graph function for multiple colors I am going to enter uh, inside the B column so the firstly I select B12 column then uh, you have to type the formula like this So they are uh, e equal sign then spark line open the brackets then uh, we use cell reference A to L then uh, within brackets you have to type uh, chart type within uh, inverted commas then um, bar which is also type within the inverted commas then max here the max value is uh, according to the example max value is what max value is 100 then the color range color 1 so, that, so then uh, we start uh, the condition part with IFS function so IFS they are the if the A twelve is the A twelve value is uh, less than twelve twenty five the color should be red. If the A twelve color is uh, A twelve value is less than twenty five then the color is red. And the second condition is if the A twelve value is less than seventy five then the color is black. So the otherwise. The, uh, otherwise otherwise if the a 12 column is less than or equal 100 if the a 12 column value is less than or equal 100 then the color should be green so that is the criteria we uh, we insert under the ifs function so there you have uh, here we have to check the formula again there may be an error that's error spark line a12 a correct chart type then the uh, ah yeah i missed one t no now it is okay now uh, formula works properly so i missed one letter t i missed letter t down the chart type bar max yeah all the things are condition part also okay now uh, let's try uh, Let's drag the formula up to A20, sorry B21. Oh, yeah, we have uh, three colors, red, black and green. So that is how you have to, uh, that is the way if you want to use multiple colors for a spark line graph. So if you want to limit to a spark line graph for uh, two colors then you have to use if function otherwise you have to use ifs function to get uh, more colors.
more uh, colors for your uh, spark line graph so if you want more videos so please subscribe my subscribe my channel so uh, if you need any clarification regarding this please put your comment under the comment section so i will answer all your questions and all your ideas are welcome therefore uh, please subscribe for more videos like this and uh, thank you for watching